hello everyone welcome to this video in which we are going to see that how can you use the option microsoft print to pdf and in case your uh, option is not visible in your pc then how can you actually get this option in your pc in your system so first of all what is this microsoft print to pdf so suppose you are on a web page or you are viewing a document you are viewing some files uh, in your browser and you want to print them but you are at a place where your printer is not connected so you want to keep a copy of those files with you in the form of a pdf so microsoft print to pdf what it does it brings up the print menu and from the print menu it creates a pdf version of your file and saves it on your system so that uh, later on once you want you can actually refer to it anytime that you want so this is the advantage of microsoft print to pdf uh, once it is converted to a pdf format it is easier to share it is easier to print it is easier to work with that particular document so uh, these are all the advantages in this video we are going to see how do we enable this option if it is not getting shown in your pc so by default as soon as you install um, acrobat reader or any other pdf documents then this option should be visible in your system along with the other print options if it is not then what steps you need to do this is what we will see in this video so you need to go to the search bar and type add and put a space for a so automatically the uh, settings that should come up with for you is add a printer or scanner so this is the settings that we need to go to just click on this so it would uh, bring up this printers and scanners menu if you see these are the printers that we are getting right now okay microsoft print to pdf uh, this is the option that i have already present in my system so that's why it is shown over here but in your case if you are facing the issues then this option won't be visible any of the other printers that are configured would be shown here as well so here what you need to do is click on add a printer or scanner so it will search for printers and scanners now if any of the printers are in your vicinity then those would be listed over here otherwise for the case of microsoft print to pdf you need to click on the printer that i want isn't listed now here this kind of a dialog box will appear from this dialog box you need to choose the last option that is add a local printer or network printer with manual settings so uh, click on next then on the existing port just select the option of file print to file click on next from here select the manufacturer as microsoft now here uh, you need to select the pdf in my case pdf is not visible because microsoft print to pdf is already configured in my case but in your case if it is not visible and it is still not configured in your case then what you need to do is just click on windows update so um once you have clicked on windows update it is going to update the list of the printers and it is going to take a few minutes so it could range from 5 to 10 minutes depending upon how much time it takes in case you need to install a driver directly from a cd just click on have disk there is a have disk option also but in the case of microsoft print to pdf we are not going to use that option because that driver is actually provided to us by windows itself so we need to click on windows update and wait for a time um, till which this windows uh, update is installed windows is actually checking all these things and once it has checked all the drivers it will give you a list of the drivers now notice that in my case it won't be visible because microsoft print to pdf is already an option for me so uh, we might have to go with some other option in your case pdf option would be visible so that you need to install okay so uh, in my case the pdf option wasn't visible because it is already ex um, used so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to select any other option like remote desktop easy print just to show you how the installation is going to work so just select this click on next um, just add a printer name you can type any name i'm just going to go with the default name click on next so this printer would be installed uh, in my case it is not actually able to complete this function but in your case the printer would be installed because i'm using a remote desktop easy print so no remote desktop is connected in my case that's why it's not able to do but in your case the printer would be installed and once it is installed then you will be able to see it over here so in the list of the printers and scanners so that's it for this video that's uh, how you can actually use this option microsoft print to pdf that's how you can install the driver uh, in your windows pc and that's it for this video thanks for watching